With the passage of a cold front, action radar is going to be taking a much needed break for tonight and through the day tomorrow. No rain is expected in the forecast until we get to Friday. Winds have been out the north and that's really bringing in some fairly dry air at the moment north at five miles per hour in Troy common enterprise, but we can expect that to be fairly persistent through the night and you can see our dew point temperatures that measure moisture in the air and that starts dropping in the 60s. That's when the air starts getting a little bit more comfortable still in the 70s, mid 70s for Mariana right now. So that drier air is going to filter in through tonight and through the day tomorrow, keeping the sky mainly clear and temperatures in the upper 80s feeling pretty good out there. The heat index temperatures will not be that much more than that. We'll be in the 70s early on. No rain expected through the afternoon, 89 degrees by three o'clock and beyond that we'll start to cool off a little bit and all in all, it's going to be a pretty nice day for Thursday afternoon. If you have to get anything done, do it tomorrow. Rain chances will return to the forecast. Overall, that uh, condition, those conditions will remain in place for Thursday. Then that's going to change a little bit for Friday afternoon. Some Gulf moisture is going to work its way back into the region. That's going to make uh, make things a little bit more humid and give us the fuel for a few afternoon showers or storms, but then clearing out likely as we do head into the evening hours. But by this weekend, we will have abundant moisture and widespread showers and storms Saturday and Sunday with the bulk of the rain likely at this point on Sunday afternoon. High pressure is building in on the backside of that cold front that's pretty much draped over us right now. Cloud cover that's to our north that's associated with that front and that's going to be sliding through as we do head into the overnight hours. So overall for tonight, mainly clear sky. Tomorrow morning temperatures will be starting out in the upper 60s. It's not out of the question that a few spots will be in the middle 60s for you, but then already by 11:45 in the morning, we're going to be warming up into the 80s simply because that dry air is able to heat up pretty quickly. High temperatures, though, thanks to that northerly breeze, will stay in the mid 80s for most locations. And then keeping that sky clear as we head into early Friday, but some extra cloud cover will come in after sunrise, and that will help to initiate a few showers or a few storms as we do head into the afternoon hours. There's that timestamp 4:15 for Friday. Showers and storms down at the coast. More sporadic activity for us here in the Wiregrass, which is going to be good news for the high school football games. Closer to home for tonight, keeping that sky clear. Temperatures warming into the 70s as we head into the 7 o'clock hour after cooling into the 60s. And then for us in the afternoon, upper 80s. So all in all, not too bad. We should be in the lower 90s for this time of year by 8 o'clock. Maybe a little bit of cloud cover coming into the picture, but nothing of consequence that will give us anything in the way of rain or storm chances. As we head into Friday, there's a storm chance coming back to the forecast. 89 degrees for that high temperature, but just a 20% chance. Then the higher storm chances will be here on Saturday and for Sunday. Next week looking pretty typical with the 90s returning to the afternoons.